Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you how to remove or hide the close button in a jQuery UI dialog box. I'm reloading the browser. See here, close button has been removed from this jQuery UI dialog box. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I'm using Notepad++. Notice in this Notepad++, just for the time saving, I have added a simple HTML code which contains a header tags, horizontal line, and after the horizontal line, I do tag with some text a demo to remove or hide the close button. Now, before creating a jQuery UI dialog box and to hide the close button, first we'll check the basic output how it looks at designing part on the browser. And this is the output of that HTML code which contains at this moment the header tags and this is the text which contains in the do element. Now let's add the jQuery UI dialog to this do container and, and after that we'll add the function on it to remove or hide the close button on this dialog box. So when we are using jQuery functionality first thing we require the latest jQuery CDR links. So let's search for jQuery CDN latest Google and from the search results I'm selecting the hosted libraries in the Google hosted libraries notice at the corner there is a contents panel which contains a jQuery and jQuery UI I require this both first we'll grab the jQuery CDN in this jQuery CDN, you can find different snippets. I'm selecting the latest version 3.3.1. So let's copy this one, the script, and add in the header section. After that, I require the jQuery UI also. Click that one. In this jQuery UI snippets, I have two links. One is the jQuery UI min.js file. And the second one is a jQuery UI.CSS link. Let's copy this both and paste in the header section. After that, I'm adding the script tag. I'm closing the script tag. Inside the script, I'm creating the jQuery dialog box. Dollar. I'm adding function. Now in this function, dollar between single quotes, I'm adding the do container ID. So here the do container ID is uh, dialog div. Let's copy this one. When we are adding IDs, we need to prefix with the hash dot dialog. Now before adding the, the close button functionality, first we'll check this div container contains a dialog box or not. Let's save this file. I'm reloading the browser. See after adding the jQuery functionality, the dialog function, we got the dialog box to the div. Now my next step is to remove or hide the close button on this dialog box this one i want to remove after the script i'm adding style i'm closing style tag inside this style i'm adding a class name dot ui dot dialog hyphen title bar name it's a predefined class name for the dialog class I'm adding the property simply add the display none and one more thing I'm not adding this class name to this do container let's save this file we'll check the final output on the browser I'm reloading the browser 
see here close button has been removed from this jquery ui dialog box that's it